Hello, Ninja Squad. Welcome back to the video, aka welcome back to part two. Today we're gonna be ranking some more Roblox driving games. These are my opinion, by the way. You guys do not have to agree with me, but today we're gonna be reviewing some more driving games. We left off with reviewing Vehicle Legends, so now we're gonna review Vehicle Legends officially. And yeah, I hope you guys are gonna enjoy this video today. If you do, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. Make sure to also join my Discord group and also make sure to follow me on Twitter and Z Series. But yeah, anyways, here's today's few shout out. And if you want to be sure to subscribe to the official NG Squad member, make sure to buy some of that fire in the description as always. But yeah, anyways, I'll see you guys in the video. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, we are on the next game, which is Vehicle Legends. Honestly, I've really not played this game. I mean, I think I have one car. Yeah, I do have one car, so I, I actually have played this game. And I also have money, so yeah. Anyways, this game is quite popular on Roblox. I've honestly seen it with a lot of players before. And it also has over over 200 million players. So, yeah, the game is really cool. You guys also got some a lot of things. You got motorcycles, boats, and aircraft, like that. You also have shop, maps. Oh. Is this the US? Ayo? Hey, what is this? What just happened? Oh, I just got teleported to another game. Okay. Anyways, now it's time to go back to the game we were just in. Alright, we are back in Vehicle Legends. That honestly took a while, but I didn't think the map would send me to another game. But we also have portable garages, and we also have Twitter codes and also settings. Uh, you, okay, actually, that's pretty cool. We also have graphics. Let's go. But honestly, this game is really cool. You also have, like, first-person driving, which is really cool. But let me see where the turn signals are. They do have turn signals? No, they do not have turn signals. But the detail of the maps is really cool. I don't really like tearing in on maps, but it's it's alright. It's alright. Well, they also have VIP server commands. Let's go. Oh, almost dies. Um, let's go over here. Whoa, 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 whoa. NZ, be careful. Okay. I mean, this game's alright. I mean, oopsies. Okay, we're going over there. 100%. Those snow mountains look so sick. Okay, NZ, come on, you can do it. Come on, NZ, you can do it. Come on, we're going over to the snow mountains. But I think it's the only car I got in like the game. So yeah, can I hop out? Uh, how do I hop out, sir? I can't hop out. F. Okay. Um, let me go ahead and hop out of my vehicle and also respawn it. Since it wanted to break. Anyways, let's go back out the mountain. I don't think we can make it over to the mountain. Yeah, it just like takes you up and up and up. But the details on the mountains are really cool. I really like the detail of that. It looks sick. But yeah, let's go down the mountain. Honestly, the game's really cool. I mean, honestly, honestly, I think this is a racing game. To me, honestly, it's a really cool game. But I honestly feel like it's a racing game. But yeah. Anyways, now it's time to go back on to the tier list. Alright, we are back on the tier list. So, we were just reviewing Vehicle Legends. So, the rating I'm going to give it for Vehicle Legends is a also a C. The game is honestly really enjoyable. It's not my type of game. It honestly feels like a racing game. So, I wouldn't give it like, that good of a rating. But, it's either a C or a B. Let me know what your guys' opinion is on Vehicle Legends. But, let's go ahead and review the next game, which is Rensselaer County. Alright, we are in our next game, which is Rensselaer County, but, yeah. Honestly, this is probably, like, a nice, like, role-playing game, but, yeah. Let's go ahead and review some of these things they actually have in the game. We have jobs, which include restaurant workers, doctors, firefighters, gas station workers, law enforcement, and DOT. Next, we have game passes and cash, which honestly includes a lot of things, which also have donations. Let's go. And we also have help information so this is where you can find out information about the game and to figure out what about the game and if you can't figure that stuff by yourself we also have settings there's a lot of things that make your quality way better for your gaming let's go here anyway the vehicle dealership they actually have a lot of like vehicles they had to have at least like, 200 300 vehicles in game we have like, sedans coupes SUVs trucks crossovers and other vehicles Let's go ahead and spawn one of the vehicles I have right now. I've actually played this game. And you guys, I mean, some of you guys probably know I am a stat member for this game. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and spawn the Selexis I do have. Okay. Let's go. 
let's go. But honestly, the game is really cool. Honestly, the game is really cool. I don't know if I really like it so much, but honestly, it's a really nice game if you're looking for a nice role-playing game. Honestly, there's a lot of buildings, so honestly, a really nice role-playing experience, honestly, for the game. Honestly, if you had to take this game for, like, it's, like, like it's word, you had to call it, like, a role-playing game. Not a racing game, but a role-playing game. I don't know if there's ever going to be a racing, like, way or something like that, but the game is really overall very cool. If you guys want to play this game for yourself, link is in the description. But the cool thing about this game is that they have a freeway. So like here right here there is a freeway which honestly goes for quite a few miles so it's cool but yeah anyways now it's time to go back over to the tier list all right we are back on the tier list now it's time to rank the game for rensselaer county so the ranking i'm also going to give for rensselaer county it's going to be a c for me honestly it honestly is a b or a c the game is overall a fun game it's honestly not a, like the type of game i would always play but honestly a really cool game that you may see on roblox but yeah now it is time to go ahead and review the next game which is richmond virginia all right we're back in our next game which is richmond virginia overall a really nice game i really don't play it but the only vehicle i really drive in game is the bmw they do have which is the 2020 bmw 330i but they also have teams we only have two teams though citizen and also police they have store and also have twitter codes they have map I can't click yet. I think it's gonna be possible feature later. But if you click the map here, can you do anything? No. And yeah, I think if you walk into the dealership, that's the only way you're gonna know the vehicles. Yeah. The vehicle things loading. Oh, they actually updated this. Let's go. They have Dodge Chargers. Looks really cool. You guys can see with this picture here. Can you move it? No. I wish I could to see the other side, but I don't think you can do anything really. But yeah, honestly, the dealership does have a lot of cars. I think this car has, no, this game actually has like at least 50 to 100 vehicles in game. But let's go ahead and drive my car. I have the BMW. Because you know, guys, I'd be driving the vehicle. Oh, okay. I don't know what happened to my car, but I guess that's normal. Waits. Wait, the vehicle like broke. For some reason it's not allowing me in my car. I don't know if this is a bug, it could be a bug. Yeah, for some reason it's not allowing me in my car. Yes, for some reason it's not allowing me in my car. I don't know if this is honestly a bug. Okay, now we're in my car, let's go. We had a few try a few times, but we're in our car now. But honestly, the game is really cool. Honestly, they do have a lot to do so soon. So yeah, it's not it's not a complete game, by the way, guys. It's still a work in progress game. They have like a lot of nice buildings in game. Honestly, from my opinion, they have places such as T-Mobile. Coles, I think that was McDonald's. Uh, Ma, I don't know what that is, but it's a gas station. I didn't know they had McDonald's in the game, but they also have some nice role playing houses in game, which is pretty cool. So, yeah, there's Ross. I think that one clothing store. Whoa. I don't really like the vehicle controls. They're really cool. But I did a few review on my channel of this game before, if you guys remember it. A lot of OGs only remember it, by the way, guys. But, yep. This looks like a strip mall. Yo, that looks sick. Uh, I don't think I can go down there. I'm pretty sure they also do have a highway on this game, but I'm not 100% sure. I go here? No. It's kind of, like, impossible to see, like, where you're going, just to make sure you're not going to fall off the map. Oh, yeah, there's, like, a off-road track over here. Which does take you to the neighborhood. So, if we go over here. 
Go, 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 NZ, come on, you can do it, NZ. I think I broke my, okay, I think, yeah, I think I broke my video. Yeah. Yeah, I just think I broke my BMW, guys, so let's go ahead and do a ranking on the tier list. Alright, let's go ahead and give it a ranking on the tier list. The game we just reviewed was Richmond, Virginia. The game ranking I'm going to go ahead and give it is also a C. The game is really enjoyable, but honestly, it just needs a little bit of work. It's, not, it's like a work in progress game, so I can't really say it's like a really cool game. So, yeah. Anyways, now it's time to go on with our next game, which is... Pacifico 2. Alright, we are on our next game, which is Pacifico 2. You guys remember really quick this game? Yeah. I mean, honestly, I haven't played this game in a minute, so... Yeah. Let's go ahead and spawn one of my cars. I do, I think I'm pretty sure I have, like, a few vehicles from the game. Uh, they're not displaying for some reason. Yeah, they're spawning in right now. Um, let's see here. So, I had, like, a game pass. Hmm, where is it? Okay, right here. BMW, there we go. You guys remember, like, I drive BMWs in games because the models are really cool. Drive. Okay, let's go. My BMW. What's this? I don't remember this. Oh, it's a Pacifico Speedway. Ayo? I haven't played this game in a bit. But yeah, let's see what's down here. The one thing I like about this game is like the back roads. Honestly, if you guys remember like like me, like um I like back roads. Back roads are really cool and yeah the mountains are really cool in like Pacifico. It's like really enjoyable and fun. Slow. Oh no. Slow NZ NZ didn't listen. It's um NZ's fault. Hot BMW though. Slow, no. NZ be going fast. Also down a bit, but yeah, you see, I'm good. I'm good to go. Let's go. Oh, they even have campers. Nice, nice, nice. No RVs. I mean RVs. Those are RVs. Let's see. Let's. And whoa. Okay. Low key, this game is really fun. If I mean, honestly, I never even know there was a new raceway. They must have really just added it. Not a hundred percent sure when they added this, but it's really cool. Nice little raceway for the game. It's a huge raceway, so yeah. Brakes. And they also have phones, which is really cool. And they also have music for your video. Oh! Okay, that's all. Um, they also have help, and they also have houses and game. So I'm gonna go ahead and reset myself so I can show you guys, like, some cool features about the game. The only reason I like this game is because of the back roads and also.
That's some nice waterfalls. Let's go. Oh, right there. There we go. Let's go. Oh. Alright, but honestly, the game is really fun. But, yeah. Anyways, now it's time to go over to the tier list. Anyways, now it's time to go ahead and review, like, the rank the game so honestly the rank i'm gonna give for this game is a b i really love the detail of the game it's honestly really 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 fun so honestly i'm gonna go ahead and give it a b honestly it's a really fun game let me know what your guys opinion is on roanoke itself but yeah anyways now it's time to go ahead and review roanoke virginia all right we are in our next game which is roanoke so let's go ahead and review some of its features so they have vehicles, a lot of like variants of the vehicles, which is Corvette, sedans, colts, hatchbacks, minivans, SUVs, trucks, and bikes. Really cool. So the one car I really like to use for game, gaming. What am I wearing? Okay. One car I really like to drive is the the baby car. You guys remember those? My live stream, if you guys remember. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, dies. Dies in the baby car. Imagine not driving the baby car. If you don't drive the baby car, then you're not pro. But the baby car is really cool. Oh no, dies, dies, dies. Another car I really like to drive is the motorbike. Let's go and drive this car. The motorcycle, of course. I don't like the, really the physics on the motorcycle for Roanoke. Sadly, it just doesn't really look that fast. And nor does it look like realistically, because you guys can see. Like, I'm not really hanging on the bike. So, yeah. Bruh. It's so slow, though. Very slow. Anyways. But honestly, the game is really fun. Things you have here is jobs. What jobs do include... Workers, shops, codes, and also settings. They also have streamer mode for me because I'm cool. You know, streamer modes need the, this type of stuff. So, yep. So, honestly, the game is really, really, really fun. Oh, oh gee, like, honestly, I did not even know they had a revamp. So, anyways. Overall, the detail of the buildings are really cool. The houses are really cool, also. Honestly, like a nice, really role-playing experience. This game, so yeah. But overall, there's like a lot of nice buildings in games, so yeah. Anyways, now it's time to go back to the tier list and rank the game. Anyways, the next, the game we were just playing was Roanoke. Now it's time to go ahead and give it a rating. The rating I would have to give for Roanoke is a B. The game overall is a very fun game for me. Honestly, it's a really fun game. Go ahead and go ahead and play it, honestly. It's a really fun game. Like, they don't get a lot of support as they usually should get for the game. Honestly, it's like a really, really fun game. So make sure to go ahead and play it. Link in the description. But, yeah. Anyways, now it's time to get on with the next game, which is Ultimate Driving. Alright, we're on the next game, which is Westover, aka Ultimate Driving. Here's the game. Overall, it's a really cool game. Like, you guys OG have to remember this game if you are, like, playing driving games. But let's go ahead and spawn a car. It's building the dealership. But, yeah. I have a few cars. So, the car we're going to be driving is this McDonald's vehicle. Black. But yeah, let's go ahead and review some of Ultimate Driving. So here's the UI of the vehicle. It's overall really cool. And you also have a lot of jobs, which honestly have 
mailman, transit driver, highway, firefighter, police officer, and you also have truck driver. You also have vehicles. You can up, you can spawn up to two vehicles within the game, and you also have the main menu, which is kind of like a settings area. And you also can buy VIP stuff and things like that. Extend VIP. What? Okay. Let's go ahead and do some more. Anyways, let's go back to Ultimate Driving. So on this game, I do have a custom play, which is NZ, and it also has um a Virginia play because yeah, you can get your custom plates. And really cool thing about this game is like it has also um it also has highways, like nice little um long highways, cause it's cool. And here's also a map, which includes a lot, not all in game, but it's like. He had to join other games. I don't know why it does that, but I wish you could honestly just play it a one in all one game. You see how long it goes? But yeah, they also have some nice freeways within Westover. Freeways, mountains, and off road areas, honestly, in game, which is really cool. They also have beach areas and a lot of cool things you can honestly experience within game. It's really fun, honestly, for its like compatibilities and things like that. Oh no! Don't die! Don't die, NT! Don't die! We tall guys, bruh. Can I go over? Yeah, I think I can. This is like very easy to trick the system. Ao didn't have to pay a toll. Heh. that was like very easy to go through it. Anyways, let's go back onto the road. Oh, what? Why can't I go on my MP? You can honestly can't really detect whenever you're on a break or not. But, yeah. Anyways, now let's have to go ahead and rank the game in the tier list. Anyways, now we're going to go ahead and rank Ultimate Driving. The rank I'm going to give for Ultimate Driving is in A tier. Overall, it, Ultimate Driving is a really known game you would honestly see on Roblox and honestly a really nice driving game which also has a lot of variances of cars. So, yeah. Anyways, the next game we're gonna go into is Hillview County Roleplay. Alright, that is going to wrap up part two. Don't worry, we have some more videos coming up. We have the last part which will be final, which will be part three. Part 3 will be including 5 games that we will review in 20 minutes. So basically, with this tier list, I like to 20 minutes long, so I don't have to keep you guys all waiting for these videos. So, yeah. The next video for Part 3 will be uploading tomorrow. The next day after this one, Part 3 will upload. And that will be the final part you'll be seeing. But, yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys are going to enjoy this series. And I hope to see you guys all in part 3. Anyways, thank you guys all for watching. Thank you guys all for subscribing. And I'll catch you guys in part 3. See you guys.